Box 8 in all three starts to date. Let's see how he fares here. Is a win and a placing from his two previous two tonight. And now they're set. Lure in motion. Favoured in pink. Bang. The entire buggy tornado missed it a length or so. Lakota was fast away. Breakaway of May 2nd, then active oval. Bogo Tornado's coming into the race with Copter Prater. Then Slingshot Sneaky, followed by Phase Day Off, Live and Love and Cyclone. Nora, but Lakota's clear from Breakaway May on the home corner. Lakota going, great guns. Lakota got home to beat. Second in the race was Breakaway May, followed by Slingshot Nora and Phase Day Off. Uh, active oval into fourth, I should say. Then Bogey Tornado, who was trap wide, followed by Phase Day Off and Live and Love. The race time is 18.24. Number one, Lakota, all the way from the handy draw for Lin Aldous. Breakaway May into second spot. Slingshot sneak into third in front of Active Opal, number six. So one through five and six, and just on their heels was the favourite. Just could not get across from that wide alley. Two lengths by two and a quarter, 2.12, 7.56, run home 10.68, 18 and 24. It's one through five, six here on race 10. Lakota, a daughter of Aston DB Megalodon, so she's very handily bred. She's won three from ten, owned and trained by Lin Aldous. Second to three with the all clear. Breakaway May by Fernando Bael, Sprightly May, Leo Vanderberg. And third to Greyhound Five, Slingshot Sneaky, Bernardo, Slingshot Spirit. All clear here, relays. Right to pay on one, three, five, six. Two lengths by two and a quarter, 18.24. The race time. Just standing by for the uh, totes to come through, and they're through now. Number one, Lakota, 390, 160. Breakaway May, 180. Slingshot Sneaky, 180. Quinella, 750. Exacta, 22. Trophic to 63. First four, 350 in the double, not one. Congratulations to Lynn Aldous, and certainly very nicely bred she is Lakota and has scored in a good time here tonight of 18 and 24 as the runners return. Lakota whelped on the 22nd day of September 2020 has her third win at start number 10. Her first crack over the shorts at Richmond and a winning performance after trialling in very handy time of 18.04. Up next is race.